I'm really excited about our young group and I think our veterans have stepped up this year. Uh, some people who did well last year are going to do much better this year. Um, but I'm truly excited about our young group of uh, athletes, both on the men's and women's side. We do have some qualifiers, and we have some very good qualifiers. Uh, first and foremost, Whitney Diggs is doing pretty good in the 400. Um, she came here from a pretty good club system where they did some good things, and we were able to uh, improve those things that she did there. Uh, right now, with her, we're working on getting her stronger and having better posture. Also, Jenna Settle, who is from Estacada, has done very well. Um, she's a pretty emotional runner, so we have to work on her knowing that it is a uh, process. Uh, the other sprinters and jumpers, CC Jackson's our multi that's taking the place of Janisha Vincent. And I think she's going to be an All-American at some point, too, as well as Bailey Sims is doing an outstanding job in both the sprints and the jumps. Uh, the returners, Jasmine Radcliffe. She went to quarterfinals last year in the hurdles. This year, she's a top seed in both the 60-meter hurdles and the Open 60. Hard worker, uh, very good academically as well, too. So looking for some really great things for her. Uh, on the freshman on the guy side, Gifton uh, is doing a great job in the jump. He's going to New York, and we think he might be able to pop into the 49 area before this indoor season over, which will hold well for him doing absolutely wonderful outdoors. Uh, a veteran athlete, and I'll just say that, Nevin Lewis. Nevin Lewis is finally free to do track and field. He's done with football completely, and I think he's going to be an outstanding decathlete.